friends, welcome back to Big Ideas for Little Learners. I'm so excited because today I get to share two pieces of farm literature with you. You are going to love these stories. This first one's really funny. It's called Doobie Doobie Moo. It's by Doreen Cronin and illustrated by Betsy Lewin. Farmer Brown keeps a very close eye on his animals. Every night he listens at the barn door. Dooby dooby moo, snores the cow. La 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 la, snores the sheep. Quack the quack the quack, duck snores. Duck keeps a very close eye on Farmer Brown. Every morning, Duck borrows his newspaper, and one day an ad catches his eye. It says, talent show, open to all. Where? At the country fair. When? On Saturday. First prize, a trampoline. Second prize, a box of chalk. Third prize, a veggie chop matic As soon as Farmer Brown opened his paper, he knew the animals were up to something. What do you think the animals are going to do? Why are they up to something? Farmer Brown watched them closely all day. He watched them from above. He watched them from below. He even watched them upside down. Outside the barn, late at night, he heard dooby dooby moo. Inside the barn, the cows rehearsed, twinkle, twinkle, little star. Dooby, 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 moo, dooby, moo, 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 moo. Needs work, Duck noted. The sheep rehearsed, home on the range. Ba, 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 ba. Duck had... Then try it again, but with more feeling. The pigs did an interpretive dance. Whack, whack, quack! Duck snored. Day after day, Farmer Brown kept a very close eye on his animals. He watched from the left, he watched from the right, he even watched in disguise. I couldn't even recognize the farmer with this disguise. What are these animals up to? Outside the barn, night after night, he heard dooby dooby moo, fa la 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 ba, quack a quack a quack. Inside the barn, night after night, the animals rehearsed. Finally, it was time for the county fair. Duck was pacing back and forth. The pigs were combing their hair and the cows were drinking tea with lemon. They are up to something, thought Farmer Brown. Farmer Brown was not going to leave them alone. He loaded all the animals into the back of his truck and drove them to the fair. When he got there, he heard dooby dooby moo. Quack, quack, quack. He parked the truck and headed off to the free barbecue. That looks like a fun fair. When Farmer Brown was out of sight, the animals ran to the talent show desk and signed in. Cows, sheep, pigs. I did not know that farm animals could write. What do you think? Can they write their own names? The cows sing, twinkle, twinkle, little star. 
The judges were clearly impressed. Looks like one judge gave a score of 8 out of 10, one judge gave a score of 8.2 out of 10, one judge only gave a 2 out of 10, and the cat must not have liked it. He only gave it a 1.2 stars out of 10. The sheep sang home on the range. Ba 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 Three of the judges were clearly impressed. A 9 out of 10, 9.1 out of 10, 8.9 out of 10. Again, the cat, not so impressed, only 2.3 out of 10. It was time for the pig's interpretive dance, but they were sound asleep. Wink, wink, wink. Wink, wink, wink. All of the judges were clearly annoyed. Duck really wanted that trampoline. He jumped up on the stage and sang, Born to be Wild. Quack, 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 quack. The judges gave him a standing ovation. See how they're all standing up and clapping? That's called a standing ovation. When Farmer Brown got back to the truck, he heard, Dooby, dooby, moo. Animals were exactly where he had left them. Farmer looks pretty happy. That night, Farmer Brown listened outside the barn door. Dooby dooby boing, ba la 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 boing, whack a whack a boing. What do you think they're doing in the barn with all that boing noise? What could that be? Oh, they won the trampoline. Silly farm animals. I hope you had fun with that story. Are you ready for the next story? It's called Oink Moo, How Do You Do? A Book of Animal Sounds by Grace Macarone. What a fun name. And illustrated by Hans Wilhelm. Look at all those farm animals. Let's see what kind of sounds we can make. Oink, moo, how do you do? I heard a rhyme. Oink, moo, how do you do? Moo and do. Ba, hee haw, come see what we saw. Ribbit, tweet, there's lots to eat. Lots of rhymes and animal sounds. Hoot, meow, let's hurry there now. Honk, nay, we're on our way. Cock-a-doodle-doo, I'm coming too. Ha, cock cock, we're in luck. Oh my goodness, look at that. Did they find a lot of food from the farm truck? Gobble, gobble, rough. We've had enough. Scat, shoo, away with you. Oh no, the farmer found them all. Cheep, 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 quack, quack, quack. Mm -hmm. Meow, oink, quack, quack. Ba, roof, ka, ka, tweet, hoot, nay, moo, squeak, ribbit, buzz, honk, gobble, cluck, 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 chip, 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 cock a doodle doo. That's a lot of animal sounds. I hope you're making some sounds for me too. Squeak, quack, quack. It's good to be back. Bzzz. What a great day it was. Cheep, cheep, cheep. 
and now to sleep. All right, friends, I hope you like these stories. I'll see you next time. Bye.